Oh, nice. Okay, so I'm going to skip ahead a little bit. These are simple. You just got to simplify them. They have the same label. You don't need a label. These down here, you got to make them the same label. Um, does everyone know how many centimeters are in a meter? Uh, 10.5. How many years in a century? 100. 100 centimeters in a meter. 10. Um, miles in a foot? One mile is how many feet? 5,280 feet. 300 in a football field. So you'll need that for this one. Meters, kilometers, kilo means a thousand. Um, ounces and pounds. Everyone know how many ounces are in a pound? Sixteen. One pound is sixteen ounces. Wait, even just forty-three feet. Okay. All right. Now I just want to show you this. Before you start, here, these are simple right here, but they're maybe hard to understand. When they want the ratio of the distances, so you just count how far is AB? It's two. And how far is CD? One, two, three. So the ratio is two thirds. Okay? Now, these right here, these problems, when they give you a ratio, that means if you had a rectangle and the ratio of the width to length is 2 to 5, you make one of them 2x one side and the other one 5x. So since it's perimeter, then this is 2x and this is 5x, you'd add all those up, set them equal to 84, and then solve for x. Then you just plug it back in to figure out the length and width. You got to do the same thing here, except it's area. One side would be 3x, the other side 4x. <coughs> On these right here, when you got a triangle, how many degrees, or what do the degrees always add up to? Close. 180. So since the, the sides, or the angles, are this ratio, you'd say... 1x plus 4x plus 7x equals 180. And then you figure out what x is, and then just plug it in here to find the three angles. Okay? So, like, say if x is 10, one angle is 10, the other one is 40, the other one is 70. You just put the x back in to find the three angles. 